Hi, we're Holiday with the Heathers. We are a married couple who have been lucky enough to have travelled to over 20 destinations over the past eight years, experiencing the culture and cuisine the world has to offer. Although the world has come to a standstill, you can still follow our life's journey by watching our weekly vlogs. We know the prospect of travel is uncertain. We don't know where, we don't know when, but we will fly again someday. I got my toast in. Mm -hmm. Morning everyone, welcome to day two of our Birmingham staycation vlog. It is about seven o'clock in the morning. Wayne and I have just gone down for breakfast, as you've just seen. I had some toast and jam and a little bit of apple juice. Well, a lot of apple juice. Everyone knows I love my apple juice. Wayne is currently still down there stuffing his face with a fry up. I got one for him just so he could have seconds. It is usually a buffet selection and they did have a buffet selection down there as you've seen but the fry up you have to order just so there's not a lot of people using the same tongs and things like that. There was tongs for the toast um, and the toaster but uh, yeah the food was lovely. It was really nice. They had a selection of cereals, fruit, yogurts, tea, coffee, orange juice, uh, croissants, muffins chocolate muffins the list went on they had jams and condiments brown sauce ketchup and it was just really lovely it's a real shame that this hotel is leaving um and will be demolished i did notice in the lift there is a fitness suite so before we go out today i will film a bit of the fitness suite um just to basically give this hotel a bit of recognition because it's so lovely it really really is lovely and for i think wayne paid about 57 pounds for two nights which is just really really good for what we've been given basically we were upgraded to a club room and we were given a free breakfast as part of the club room but i believe there might be a pool so i'll go and film the fitness suite when i have woken up from my slumber because i am going to go back to bed I'm feeling a little bit fatigued today, I think with all the traveling yesterday, although it was a really quick journey. Um, we got a bus to Watford Junction, and for anyone who doesn't know, Watford is a town in Hertfordshire, and from Watford Junction train station, we were able to get a train to Birmingham New Street, which just took over an hour, which is amazing. I believe the train also goes to Crewe, which is one of the stops that I usually get off at if I'm going to see my family in the Wirral. I can get a train straight to Liverpool, but I just find I'd rather do the journey split up if it's going to work out cheaper. So for now, I'm going to get back into this comfortable bed and relax. I know you shouldn't go to sleep on a full stomach. I've only had a piece of toast, but I'm going to relax. And then about half past 10, we're going to get up and get ready. We're hoping that the rain doesn't become too bad. It's saying it's got a 90% chance of rain. I will put the forecast just here. Um, and it was lovely yesterday. The weather was glorious. It wasn't too hot. It was about 26 degrees. And today we are pretty much inside for most of the day. At 2 p.m. We, we have a reservation for 
Birmingham Sea Life Centre with the Merlin passes. And I think before we go there, about lunchtime, we're going to go back to the UK's biggest Primark, which is near the Bull Ring, and we are going to try the Mickey Waffles, um, which will be about lunchtime. Wayne has got some food left over from our train journey, so that will be his pack lunch, and we will have that when we're at the Sea Life Centre about two o'clock. And then later on this evening, once we finish the Sea Life Centre, we may go to a Cine World, depending on how bad the weather is and how long the walk is. But today is going to be pretty much a chilled one. We probably will go back round the ball ring after the Sea Life Centre just to show you more of the shops. Yesterday we've shown you the Disney store and a few other shops. But for now, I am going to get back into this... Ugh, can't even speak. Today I'm going to get back into this beautiful, comfortable bed and I will see you when we wake up at 10.30. Do it with me, Lee. So, Jess, where are we? We are at the Primark Disney Cafe in Birmingham, in the world's biggest Primark, and we are very excited. I'm very excited. We are sharing Mickey Waffles with banana cookies and unicorn sauce. <laughs> We've got a seven up, a tea for Wayne and a water to share. And we also wanted to show you the menu. It's got a QR code on it, so Wayne's gonna film that now and you can just press pause on it if you'd like to see the costumes. And they do a children's menu and an adult menu and a general menu but Mickey waffles and pancakes are served all day so we are going to wait for our food and tuck in and then we're going to the Sea Life Centre in Birmingham. <laughs> We've got Mickey waffles! <laughs> Trying my first Mickey waffle. Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> now my turn. Ready? <laughs> Mickey waffles. <laughs> So we're just outside the Sea Life Centre in Birmingham. We're going to swap over to the camera now so you can see all the amazing aquatic life animals, including sea otters, on our Canon G7X Mark II. So we will see you on the camera inside. <laughs>
the penguin. Uh, can't see. Too quick. Oh. Penguins, anyway, yeah. Um, and we're gonna go up now. It's not even steep, but if Wayne just turns the camera around, we will show you. It's all on what's like uh, ramps. ramps, but they're really level, so if you do have disabilities, it's really great. So I'm really excited. Yeah. Also, yeah, I don't think there's any stairs in there, is there? No. I think it is literally all ramps. So it's suitable for people with cramps and disabilities. Yeah, if you're in a wheelchair or mobility issues, it should be fine now, shouldn't it? And there is toilets as soon as you get in as well. Yeah. You didn't have to wait longer than, say, five minutes. No. So we're going to enjoy the animals and we will show you what is next. Mesmerising, aren't they? Wayne and I have said when we get our forever home, because that's something we're going to talk to you guys about on the channel because we haven't got a clue about getting a mortgage. It won't be for another five, six years, but we are going to invest. It'll probably by the time we're 50 and our kids are older, but we are going to invest in a really expensive aquatic fish tank yeah. because Wayne and I had our first date in Baltimore Aquarium and it's where we said we love each other. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the fishies. <laughs> We're all lovey-dovey, aren't we? Because yeah. it's our anniversary. Alright, snap it out. Makes everyone go. Yeah. So this is some of the fishes that were in the tank that we've just shown you. So have you spotted any? A fox, fox face rabbit fish. Oh, we're not doing that again where we yeah. try and pronounce everything, are we? So have you spotted any of these fish? These are the fish that were in the tank. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Fishy. And that is a regal tang or a pajama cardinal fish, either one. He deserves some air time, doesn't yeah. he? Bye, fishy. Oh yeah, or catfish. You're tanking your living room. There is a stingray in here, I think. Yeah. Or a man it's not a manta ray, is it? That's a classic. It's a stingray. Look out for the stingray. I need them. No. no. Sure. Wow, look at Yes. 
Do this or do you want to touch him? I'll let you touch him. Up here on you. Am I, am I okay to film just my wife? Yeah. Get me on YouTube. <laughs> oh wow! It's kind of weird, isn't it? Yeah, it feels like a rock. It does, yeah, yeah. And if you're feeling really good, that's another one under there that feels clean, isn't it? Oh, it's like, um, like it's squishy. Yeah, yeah. Some people think it's a bit of a rock. That is massive. That's one of the biggest one I've ever seen. Between four and twenty. Yeah, it's like see it. Emily. 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 <laughs> you do not need to find Dory. Do you want to get in there? Go on, I tell you. If you've got little ones, you can get in this little tunnel.
So sometimes fish ain't friends. So don't touch them because it'll hurt them. They'll tell you which ones you can touch because there'll always be a staff member and a hand washing station. Yeah. Like those starfish, you're allowed to touch them because we weren't going to cause any harm. So just because fish are friends, it doesn't mean you can touch them. different actually. I think it was Prana. Hiya! <laughs> Hiya! Hiya! I ain't getting in there. You crawling my right through? Yeah. Hey, I'll pass with the camera. No, it's alright. <laughs> too old for this shite. Going through these Fishies. 
We are now entering the Amazon. There's no otters in the Amazon, though, is there? I don't know, I don't think so. I'm really impressed with this place, you know. Yeah, really, really it's good, isn't it? I'm not finding the walk difficult at all. Yeah. More fishies. Better I um, better view now, isn't there? Yeah. From that big tank from earlier. It smells like proper um, like aquarium. Yeah. Isn't it? We're in an aquarium, but. Ooh, what's in here? Oh, I don't know. Let's go and find out. Are you still filming? Yeah. We've got the viewing platform for the starfish. Yeah, this is down there is where you saw Jessica stroke the starfish and that's not a metaphor either. Jess, it looks like there's no otters. Your favourite animal is not here today. Ola and Izzy, Ozzy, are not here today. That's the tank that they should have been in, but I think it's being cleaned or something, so I'm not sure why. Yeah, we found them. Yeah. 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 Oh, I can see him. Yeah, they're gorgeous, absolutely stunning, aren't they? Just give me the ancient ones, the little ones. Yeah. They're the short clawed. Yeah. They're massive, those ones. Oh, you can see the little eggs. Oh, look at them on the back. See, I'm just through there. Yeah. Did you see him looking? Oh, there's a little one there. Yeah. Right there. 
So we've just found out that the otters are going to be fed in 10 minutes. So we're going to sort of linger around the otter tank and wait for that. Obviously we'll show you them as well. These are Jessica's favourite animals of all time. So she is made up to see these. Do they carry the pebbles like the little ones? Um, so they use pebbles to crack up and things like bombshells and that. Oh, yeah. So they'll kind of smash down on them with a stone. Uh, we don't actually give them pebbles or anything like that in here yeah. because they would absolutely destroy their enclosure. No. <laughs> uh, but we do give them ice treats. Oh. Smash. Yeah, uh, so, yeah, they'll smash uh, bits of ice on each other, and we give them. Oh, oh you are killing <laughs> me right now! You are so beautiful. <laughs> uh, so this is Rainy. This is our girl. She's oh, wow. She's the smaller of the two. He's a little bit bigger. <gasps> These were the Asian short I don't know because the little ones are cute, yeah. but these ones, like, I'd say, I've never seen these up close yeah. like this before. I don't think I've ever seen one like this. <laughs> Just catch it on the belly, it's great. 
Asian short clawed otters for me are the best. Well, but I think next time we go to paradise, it'll all change again. Yeah. Oh, they were so cute, weren't they? Yeah. Catching it on the big belt. <laughs> <laughs> the staff was so helpful. Yeah. Did you enjoy that? They're amazing, aren't they? I'm missing the party. I'm the one. It's uh, Sean and Steph. Steph. Steph, so yeah. Steph, these are for you if you're watching. We love you. I think it's those ones she likes. It might be, we'll go over there in a sec. Well, like burgers, didn't they? <laughs> Mushrooms. Burgers, those for me. Cassiopeia. Isn't that the name of my cat? Constellation. filming this uh, there's five flights so for anyone ah, no so you're gonna have to take the lift oh, there's a lift yeah do you want to go in yeah. uh, I don't know there and see that. That was massive, wasn't it? Is it? Don't think he's around here again now. He might be over by the tunnel. Oh, there he is. Oh, just come back round. There he is, mate. <laughs> wow. I don't think he's going to come back round, though. No. Should we go around the tunnel then, yeah? Probably see him. At the moment, yeah, I'd say it's. But then again, we haven't been to the London one in a couple of years, so I can't remember too much. Oh my god! Jeez.
Yes, yes. for that we don't want to eat sharks do we no. we're going to keep them TV, didn't we? Help the beluga friends. Weren't they in Japan? Yeah, it was a little grey. Yeah. Dark, meet little grey and little white. Oh, yeah. Oh, the are in Maybe it's not, not working, working at the moment. No, I just needs a man's touch. Oh, oh pardon me. Brilliant. brilliant that was brilliant. Oh, it's been brilliant. No, we've got to get a key ring. So that, yeah. Just recording these prices because people want to know.
Yeah, it was really good that was. Yeah. Ollie's. Oh, Ollie Otter's okay. canal, side. canal side adventure trail. <laughs> oh, is there otters here? Yeah, the little otter there. Ollie the otter. Yeah. So you had a good time? Oh, it was brilliant. I, can't, I wouldn't say it's good as uh, London Aquarium because I haven't been for a few years and I no. can't remember it. But at the moment, that's my favourite. Yeah, it was amazing. Yeah. You wouldn't think a little building. Well, it's not exactly little like that would have such amazing animals inside yeah. and i don't know how i feel usually about them being in there but knowing that they can't survive on their own yeah. makes me smile because that woman was I'm, so dedicated wasn't she what was her name i can't think of that though so I'm, I'm all for zoos and aquariums like that i mean i do believe if they give back to conservation i do believe they should be free and yeah. wild like it, as natural as they should be but in some stances it can't be can it yeah. We just needed to address this because we've been getting a, a bit of hate on our zoo vlogs. We're not going to stop posting aquariums and zoos and safari parks. But at the end of the day, it's what we love doing. And every single place that we go to gives back to conservation. Yeah. And they rehome a lot of the animals as well. Like I said, I'd rather them be free and live in their natural habitat. But that's not always the case is it can't no. always happen some of these have been born some of these were orphaned weren't they and yeah. they can't survive on their own so yeah but we've had a fantastic day yeah and we are going to explore the rest of birmingham city center so we will see you soon use